When I did this question, I immediately just wrote down the sequence A, B, C, and then the numbers that we know, 8, 13, and 25. And I then wrote down some equations. So after the first three terms, each term is the sum of the three previous terms. So to get to 8, it's going to be A plus B plus C, which is not much good at the moment. To get 13, it's going to be B plus C plus 8. But to get 25, it's going to be C plus 8 plus 13. And that is actually the key one. Maybe you can just look at it and see that. And now, in hindsight, it's very, you know, I can see it. But I wrote down the other ones um, first. So that means 25 is C plus 21. And therefore, C is going to equal 4. And once I've got that, I can work out the other ones. So now I've got 4 here. I've got 12. And B is going to equal 1. Therefore, the first term, right, well, actually, I've got 8 is equal to, this is going to be 5. So um, eight, uh, A is going to be 8 minus 5. It's got to be 3.